Hey, it's Tim Conway, Jr. here from Morongo. Now, a lot of people don't know this, but I am the best blackjack player at KFI. And I know all the rules. I gamble a little, hence the $8 shirt. And so I like to take a little more chance than most people when it comes to blackjack. So I'll, I'll entertain all questions from you novices out there that are broke because you don't know how to play the game like I do. Question number one, when do you split in blackjack uh, when you got no more money? Take off. No, I would look right here where we have the A showing. I would probably take insurance here, and that means you insure whether this card underneath there is a 10. So if you took insurance, you lose the insurance. It's not covered with homeowners or your car insurance, by the way. Um, okay, then you got eights here. I would split the eights because 16 is a terrible hand. So you take one hit. Oh, now you got three eights. Look at that. I'd split them again. Now you got three eights. I'd hit the first one 10, double that down, 15. I would probably hit again, bust. Bad vibes. All right, eight, 18. I'd stay on 18 there. I would double down 11, and you end up with uh, 15. I don't know, I'd hit that. 17, I'd stay. Split the aces against an ace. You get one card each, the 10 there and a three there. You'll probably win one, probably not win that one. Uh, you probably want, you, you now know there's not a 10 under there. So you're not gonna take even money. You're gonna hold out for uh, uh, one and a half times payoff on that. So if you bet 100 bucks, you get 150 back, plus your original bet. I would double the, uh, the, the 11 down there, take one card, and it is a 10, so you get a 21. All right, let's see what we got here. An ace and a four, five or 15, ooh, 20. Bad vibes here, that's a loss. Let's see here, that's a loss at 17. There's a winner. There's a loser, there's a winner, and there is a winner. So one, two, three hands won, but you needed 21 to win, which is a little difficult to get. 21, 21, 21, they all win. Now on to the next hand, and next question. Ooh, surrender and blackjack, great question. All right, if you have an ace here, the deal has an ace, underneath here could be a 10, you could be in bad, bad shape. Now, this is a 15. If you hit it, you're most likely going over. I would surrender that hand at 15. And what that means is you turn your hand over, you give it back to the dealer, and then he gives you, or she gives you, half of your bet back. So you only lose half of your bet. 12, I would surrender that as well. So if you bet 100, you get 50 back. I would stay with 19. Obviously, stay with blackjack. You're gonna get, uh, unless there's a 10 under here, there's not, then you're gonna get uh, one and a half times your bet. A 13, I would, I would surrender but just for this case, let's hit it and see. 14, uh, well, let's just pile on all of them. 38, loser. Okay, here we go. Now we have a 19 and a 21. Next card off. Oh, we have 19 already, look at that, ding dong. So 19 ties here, pushes here, wins here, only one of the five hands won. The other people went home with half their money. And, you know, it's not a bad bet uh, to surrender if you've got a really bad hand and the dealer's showing an ace. Next question, please. Uh, what do you want? Good cards. No, I, I would tip a, a blackjack dealer if the table's hot and you're getting blackjack, you're tripling your money. Um, maybe you've started with 100 bucks, you got 300 bucks. Lay a, a, you know, a 10 or a quarter on him. But you always, say, always ask the dealers as well whether they get to keep their own tips. Because um, a lot of dealers, the tip goes into a dip, uh, into a pool, and they split it all up, and so you could really, you know, be on the cheap when it comes to that. Throw him ten bucks. But if he's keeping his own tips and he's tripled your money, hey, give him twenty five bucks. You know, he uh, likely will give you, you know, good cards and good advice. Because these dealers want you to win. You know, the more you win, the more you tip, and the more they make. So ultimately, they want you to win. 